As you can tell, it's windy. Right when I go on that side of the trailer, it nails me. I am uh, hoping that this wind doesn't uh, affect this video a lot. Uh, last video, or as you will see, we did a pigeon hunt, shot 200, uh, 200 pigeon, man. It was a heck of a hunt, heck of a hunt. Andrew and Austin had a heck of a time, man. We, we killed it. 200 pigeons all in one morning. This evening, we are, I'll show you again, beware of the wind. Hey, we are uh, setting up goose again. We got a roost right across the road from us. We're gonna set up in these, uh, in this weeds and by this old silo underneath these trees. So, uh, wish us luck. Hope you guys enjoy the video. I hope it turns out good. We got the boys here with us. Shut up, Easton. Snows will get up 15 times. That'll only happen 10 more times. <laughs> Talking about maple leaves. When they're cupped up. Yeah, when they're flapping, going upside down and Dude, stupid there were, shit. There were a few groups this morning that were maybe. Here you go, I, you can have it. Is that still worth going? <laughs> oh my god. What do you want to do? <laughs> Holy shit. Getting ready to jump. I'm gonna run out. Are you guys ready behind me? Yep. Ready? You rolling on your camera? Is my camera rolling? Yeah. One, two, three.
No way that was that. That ain't bad. Holy smokes. Coming your way! Andrew. Holy shit. Got it. We got. Let's get in. There's, there's still. What is up, guys? Uh, so sorry that uh, video kind of ended. Uh, pretty abruptly but um that day man I, w I was pretty worn out i drank a red bull before we went man i was on the downhill that thing was wearing off so i was ready to get out of there i had a lot of a lot of uh decoys to pick up so sorry about that so as you could tell those birds just did not do what we wanted them to uh, originally do yes wade i still have your hoodie so <laughs> But back to what I was saying, those birds just didn't do what we wanted them to do. We were set up across the road from where they were roosting. So uh, we were tucked in that silo, that, that tree patch, and uh, they just didn't want to land that close to it. No matter how many decoys we had out, they landed outside those decoys, so we had to do something, you know. But I am getting some feedback in the comments. Uh, a big question on YouTube and on my Instagram is uh, how do we have so many decoys. We're not an outfitter, uh, but how do we have so many decoys? I'm actually in the process of making a video explaining that whole deal and just giving everybody, and especially the beginners that only have maybe a dozen or two decoys, I know they're expensive, but give you guys some information of how you can acquire a lot more decoys for a lot less price, and I just kind of give you some tips to really get in the game of that. So be looking out for that video. It should be coming up uh, here shortly. But other than that, go check that video out. It should be really informative for especially those, uh, those of you that are beginners. So look out for that. But we're going to wrap this thing up with subscriber photo contest. First off, we're just going to dive right into it. Mr. Sexy Single Man himself, Austin Bonsell. <laughs> you guys are going to love these photos. What up, Austin? Thanks for sending them. Can't wait to have you back down to hunt. <laughs> Got to uh, love that senior, uh, <laughs> that senior picture action right there. But our next one moving on is uh, going to be Hunt Fish Hole. I didn't get his name. That's just his Instagram name. Uh, this picture why I like it man look at the clouds look at that background behind them that sky just really man sits it off for me as far as photography talking about you know but uh, check it out so yeah see that sky just just great photo dude thanks for sending in man so as I said prior I'm gonna be having some uh, good tip videos coming out for uh, guys wanting to acquire more and more decoys for less price some really good information there if you guys have any good questions you know good questions I mean a ton of questions out there but if you guys have any questions about acquiring more decoys scouting shooting better uh, safety anything like that let me know in the comments I'm always checking them and uh, always getting great ideas off of them I've been hunting for you know waterfowl hunting for about 15 years so I got a lot of information that I just don't remember that might be informative and useful to you guys so any questions holler at me man so as you can tell these uh, waterfowl videos are coming late in the season after the season I hunted a bunch this year and uh, I got about two more to put up so stick around those will be coming also but I want to thank you guys for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please go subscribe. I think I'm like 30 away from 1,000. That's a huge benchmark for me, so please go help me out with that. There's a bunch more informative and great hunts to come, guys. So please go subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.